to another video on my channel. Um, I'm going to be discussing Ron Rivera uh, naming Sam Howell and and or Taylor, he Taylor Heineke the starter for the game against the Cowboys. Uh, I'll also be discussing uh, Ron Rivera being old and he really should be fired. And more on that, things like that. But um, before I do that, uh, an update because I did I did say I would update it on my channel uh, as I went along. Um, on a serious note, before we we get into Washington conversation, um, providing an update on uh, Demar Hamlin currently still in the hospital, still uh, with uh, in critical condition. However, I am hearing through reports, ESPN, Fox, NFL, that he's actually getting better and better. He's being sedated, but still, um, you know, he's he's getting better and better. So the NFL has a lot of things to, to, to consider uh, for the Buffalo Bills and the game and all that stuff. And I'm not going to talk about it, but, you know, just providing you all with an update that he um, – is getting, you know, from what I hear from family, friends, uh, representatives of his, is that he's getting better. He's still in critical condition, but improving each day. So, again, thoughts and prayers go out to him and his family from the RTS uh, with Oscar Montiel channel. So, um, but to segue into, um, into Ron Rivera talk and into Commander's talk, let's talk about We are going to segue with this little audio nugget. To clarify, you said you would talk about quarterback next week. If you guys are eliminated today by what happens at 4 o'clock, is Sam Howell in consideration? We can be eliminated. Yeah, if the Packers beat the Vikings, no duh, you then you guys hag. are eliminated. All right. Um... All right, so obviously I don't, I don't know what happened to Ron Rivera there. I don't know if he actually was being cute or if he's actually old and didn't know. I just don't know. But that really, when he when that clip came out, I was not happy. I was not impressed. And I don't think any Commanders fans were impressed when he was like, oh, we can be eliminated, huh? Huh? Bro. Did you not know the stakes of the game? Did you think that the rounds were going to be a pushover? Really? Really? I, I don't know what to say, y'all. Like, ugh, Ron Rivera, man. Like, this... I just don't know what to say. I, I, I really don't. Um, This is why he should be fired. Being all conservative, being River Boat Ron. That boat is going to... His his name is now River Sinking Ron. He needs to go. Um, And then to, to top it all off, which makes me even... Oh. To top it all off, sorry, my echo went off. Um, he's he's debating on going back to Taylor Heineke against the Dallas Cowboys. It's Cowboys week, by the way. I'm gonna be on Ch uh, Jason's uh, channel, J Sports, uh, later today. We're gonna be discussing Washington and Dallas and a bunch of uh, other NFL stuff. So make sure you guys check him out. Uh, I'll put his link in the description. Go ahead and do that. But, um, man, Ron Rivera, like, you gotta be, you, you gotta be kidding me. You did not know that you could be eliminated if you lost to the Browns and if the Packers won. Did you not know the playoff scenarios? Like, come on, bro. Come on. Uh, and then to top it all off before I was really interrupted by my echo, um, he's thinking of going back to Taylor Heineke. Why? 
No, 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 no. Don't get me wrong. I don't want Carson Wentz on the field. But this is the Sam Howell show. And from what I'm hearing, Sam Howell will get some playing time. He should get all the playing time. We need to find out if Sam Howell is the guy for the foreseeable future. And this is the game to do it, unfortunately, for the commanders. The Cowboys have something to play for. Sure, whatever. You know, and... To be honest, after a few days, I've been sitting on this, and I'm, I still feel the sting. That we could have been up there, but because of Ron Rivera's stupid decision-making, we're not. Um. So this should be the Sam Howell show. Me, personally, if I was Taylor Heineke, and I said, oh, you want me to be the starter for nothing now? Really? No. Heck no. I would, I would have said, coach, I'm going home. That was so. That was so messed up. This should just play Sam Howell for the rest of the, uh, you know for the entire game. We gotta see what he's made of at this point. Ron Rivera needs to be fired. Like I stated so many times before, it's not gonna happen. We're doomed for another year of Ron Rivera unless Dan Snyder comes out of hiding, fires him, and goes back into hiding before he sells the team. Well, I don't. I don't see that happening. I guess we'll have to wait and see. I, I don't know. Like, And another thing I want to talk about. Derek Carr. I don't want to see another veteran in here. Derek Carr is worse than Carson Wentz. He's been in the league longer and has only had one playoff appearance Chokes when it matters the most. Don't get me. Oh, he knows Jack Del Rio. Okay, and he not that good. Period. That's that's future QB talk. I'll probably talk about more about that on Jason's channel later today. But Dallas Week, man, that was just ridiculous. The way that that happened like that. Carson Wentz gets named the starter. Taylor Heineke is on the bench. They boo him because Carson Wentz is trash. And Ron Rivera, oh, we can be eliminated? Do you not know what's going on in the NFL? Are you in a bubble, man? Really? Come on, bro. Like, are you old or are you stupid? Or both? Well, I know you're old, but are you stupid? I guess you are, if you didn't know the playoff scenarios. Someone in analytics should have been telling you, yo, coach, or Ron, whatever they call him, this, th we need to win this, because if we win out, we're good. If we lose, we need this, this, and team to... Yeah. Man, this... Oh, my God. Oh, just... Before I get even more mad, I'm just going to end the video here. Um, if you're finding me for the first time, make sure you hit that sub button. Make sure you hit that like button. Again, I didn't want to say it at the beginning because I was covering something serious. Again, like I said at the beginning, prayer goes out to DeMar Hamlin and his family. Um, hopefully everything turns out. Uh, progress is being made with him. But from here, from RTS with Oscar Montiel, prayers goes out. All right, guys, keep it real. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.